At Blue White, we're working with permanent crop growers throughout the California market to transform their existing fleet of tractors into autonomous tractors. We exist to give the growers back the control that they've lost. We are helping them save upwards of 85% of their operational costs. There's so many factors that are impacting the, the agriculture market, whether that be the public markets, the cost of the commodities overseas, the cost of labor. We install our technology on top of the platform that's uh, existing on their farm, and we are, are making these tractors so that they can be operated by the growers remotely with less tractors in the field, with less operators in the field, and really maximizing their productivity and their profits. So the, the market opportunity for autonomy in agriculture is, is truly unlimited at this point. When we utilize the best in the robotics and the best in humans, we actually bring the cost-effective solution to the farm. Humans will do the things that only humans can do and all the hard work, the dangerous one, uh, working in very hot environment will be the robots. So it will be constant, day and night, 24-7, the exact product that is needed for the grower. The agriculture industry is crucial to our survival as obviously a human race, but also to the economies in the United States, California, and throughout the world. You know, and how do we make it so there is a foundation and there's resiliency you know, in the farms, in our, our food supply? Because the, the, the true danger that we're facing here is that there's not enough focus on how are we going to feed 10 billion people over the next few years. It has to do with water shortages, it has to do with the changing environment. And what does the population in 2050 look like? And where is our food supply going to be coming from? There isn't a lot of technology that has really come into the space yet, especially for the permanent crop growers. We need to drive as good as a human. One of the main differences in the last decade is the, the appearance of the LiDAR. The ability to see much more than humans. It's a 360 system, 3D, very high rate of frames. So the ability to see in one snap the entire surroundings and to really understand distances and realization of objects, that makes the LiDAR as first and, and essential. We have built a system that's relying on our LiDAR. So as the tractor is driving down the row, the system is able to make real-time decisions utilizing the LiDAR, which is very unique to what we are doing uh, at Blue White. It's helping them be able to produce more food with less input, to be able to increase their productivity in a way that, that helps them to capture more of their profits so they can reinvest it into their business and continue to grow. When we were looking for our partner for our main sensor, we wanted a company that was gonna be flexible and essentially be a design partner with us. And we found that Ouster was that partner. As our tractors are working in different types of crops, they've been able to, to help customize these products to be able to recognize specific aspects in these crops. We utilize the LiDAR to not only detect for objects that might be in its path, but also to ensure that there actually is a tree there. So the LiDAR is truly the, the most important sensor that we use, and that's why we feel so comfortable using Ouster. When you combine the ability to work with a company like an engineering partner, it's a very important thing. We need a great product and a great team to work with, and Ouster is the right partner for us. The future of agriculture, in my mind, is you know, you've got a central hub and a total connected farm where every aspect from planting seeds, to planting trees, to your spray and your sanitation operations, all the way through harvest is all done remotely. If you've got all the machines in your farm talking to each other and working together, you're getting more done, you're saving more of the money that you're, you're working so hard for, and you are cementing a foundation for the supply chain as we go forward.